Mary Tyler Moore, a legendary figure in entertainment, encountered numerous challenges and hardships throughout her life, publicly and privately. While she's celebrated for her iconic roles in television and her advocacy work for diabetes awareness and addiction recovery, her personal journey was marked by hardships that tested her resilience and determination. Join Facts First as we present The Dark Secret Mary Tyler Moore Kept Hidden Until Her Death. Battle with Diabetes Mary Tyler Moore is not only known for her iconic roles on television, but also for her courageous battles with diabetes. She was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes at age 33, and she became a prominent advocate for diabetes awareness and research throughout her life. Her diagnosis with type 1 diabetes was a life-changing moment for her. At the time, she was a successful actress, known for her roles in The Dick Van Dyke Show and The Mary Tyler Moore Show. Her diagnosis meant she had to make significant adjustments to her lifestyle and daily routines to manage her condition effectively. One of the most remarkable aspects of Mary Tyler Moore's battle with diabetes was her determination to raise awareness about the disease. She used her celebrity status as a platform to educate the public about diabetes and to advocate for research funding. Moore became the international chairman of the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation, JDRF, a role she held for over three decades. She played a vital role in raising funds for diabetes research and supporting initiatives aimed at finding a cure for the disease. Throughout her life, Mary Tyler Moore faced numerous challenges related to diabetes. She experienced various health complications associated with the condition, including vision problems and kidney issues. But she remained committed to managing her diabetes and encouraging others to do the same. She often spoke openly about her struggles and the importance of proper diabetes management, including medication, diet, and exercise. Her diabetes advocacy work earned her numerous accolades and awards, including the JDRF's Humanitarian of the Year Award. Her tireless efforts in raising awareness about diabetes and advancing research had a significant impact on the diabetes community. She passed away in 2017 at age 80, but her legacy in the fight against diabetes lives on. Her advocacy work and willingness to share her personal struggles with the disease continue to inspire and educate people around the world. Mary's Mother's Struggles Mary Tyler Moore's mother, Marjorie Hackett, battled alcoholism during her life, and this had a big impact on Mary herself. Mary was open about her mother's struggles with alcoholism and the challenges it presented to their family. In her memoir, After All, Mary shared her personal experiences growing up with a mother who had alcohol addiction issues. She described the emotional toll it took on her and her family, recounting the pain and turmoil caused by her mother's addiction. Moore's candidness about her mother's alcoholism aimed to shed light on the devastating effects of addiction and on individuals and their loved ones. Mary became an advocate for addiction recovery and treatment. She acknowledged the importance of seeking help and support for those struggling with substance abuse issues. Her own experiences with her mother's alcoholism likely contributed to her commitment to raising awareness about addiction and advocating for those in need of assistance. The Death of Her Son the tragic death of Mary Tyler Moore's son, Richard Meeker Jr., was a deeply sorrowful chapter in her life. Richard Meeker Jr., often referred to as Richie, was Moore's only child, born July 3, 1956. His life was marked by challenges and struggles, particularly related to substance abuse and mental health issues. Richie's difficulties with substance abuse began at a young age, and despite his mother's best efforts to support him and seek treatment, he faced a long battle with addiction. This battle took a toll on Mary Tyler Moore, who was deeply concerned for her son's well-being and made many efforts to help him overcome his struggles. Unfortunately, Richie Meeker's struggles with addiction ultimately led to a tragic end. On October 14, 1980, at age 24, he accidentally shot and killed himself. The devastating loss was an immense tragedy for Mary Tyler Moore and her family. The loss of her son had a profound impact on Mary, and she was candid about her grief and the difficulties she faced in coping with his death. In the wake of this tragedy, Moore continued to advocate for mental health awareness and support for people and families dealing with addiction and mental health issues. Richie Meeker's death served as a stark reminder of the devastating consequences of addiction and the importance of providing resources and support to those in need. 
Mary Tyler Moore's own experience with her son's struggles undoubtedly fueled her commitment to raising awareness about these issues and working to help others facing similar challenges. While Mary is celebrated for her achievements in the entertainment industry and her advocacy work for diabetes and addiction awareness, the loss of her son remains a heart-wrenching and tragic aspect of her life story. Her eyesight struggles Mary faced significant challenges with her eyesight during her life. As we covered, she was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes at age 33, and this condition played a substantial role in her eyesight issues. Diabetic retinopathy One of the most common complications of diabetes is diabetic retinopathy, a condition caused by damage to the blood vessels in the tissue at the back of the eye, the retina. More suffered from this condition, which is a leading cause of blindness in American adults. It can cause symptoms ranging from slightly blurred vision to complete loss of vision. Moore's battle with eyesight issues was not just a personal struggle. It also became a platform for her advocacy work. She used her public profile to raise awareness about the challenges of living with diabetes and the importance of regular eye examinations to prevent diabetic retinopathy. Her efforts significantly contributed to public education about diabetes and its complications. Over the years, Mary underwent several surgeries to save her vision. These included procedures to correct issues caused by diabetic retinopathy. While Moore's eyesight issues did present challenges, she continued to work in television and film. Her condition, however, did require adaptations in her work environment. For example, scripts were printed in large fonts to aid her reading, and she sometimes needed assistance in navigating sets. Her open discussion of her eyesight issues and diabetes helped to destigmatize these conditions. She became a role model for many people living with similar challenges, demonstrating that it was possible to have a successful career and a fulfilling life despite such health issues. Her death. Mary Tyler Moore passed away January 25, 2017, at age 80. She died at Greenwich Hospital in Greenwich, Connecticut, following complications from pneumonia. Her death marked the end of an era, and it deeply saddened fans, friends, and colleagues who had admired her iconic contributions to television and her advocacy work over the years. Mary Tyler Moore's passing was met with an outpouring of tributes and condolences from across the entertainment industry and beyond. She left a lasting legacy as a trailblazing actress, a diabetes awareness advocate, and an inspirational figure who had touched the lives of many with her talent and compassion. Now it's time to hear from you. Did you know about all the struggles that Mary went through? Let us know in the comments section below.